Hey shitheads, this is a true story about me and a guy named Kevin Grosskost. One day we're hanging out and we are getting fucking smashed and we're fucking blazing it up and we're fucking out of it. And Kevin all of a sudden says, dude, Don, I have an idea. Let's go to the funeral home in the hood. And by the hood, I meant Ashland. So fucking we go there and I forget what it's called. Whatever. Don't judge me for that. I don't care. Give a fuck on this. That's fucking asshole. Anyway, we get there. And we're having a good time. I'm making him laugh. He's making me laugh. It is a good time. All of a sudden, Tevin brings out this this little thing, this fucking stupid fuck thing to take, and we both take it. About a half hour later, I'm like, Tevin? I am freaking out. I don't know what is wrong with me. And that lasted maybe about seven or eight hours. I don't know. It could have been five minutes for all I know. I think Tevin was crawling on the ground, acting like a demon clown or something, a spider, something. I don't remember. I was kind of tripping balls. Well, this phone just keeps going off, pissing me off. It's ruining my whole segment. Anyway, <laughs> so fucking, where was I? Oh, the rabbi comes in. And he's like, what are you doing on these premises? Tevin gives him a fucking right cross. I'm like, Tevin, you're a dick for doing that. And he's like, Don, relax. He's just an asshole. And I was like, you know something? You're fucking right. Tevin, you know this is fucking true, so don't fucking deny it. Anyway, the rabbi's on the ground, and all of a sudden, I don't know if I imagined it or not or whatever, but a fucking leprechaun came through the fucking casket, and he was eating the dead man's brains. I freaked out. I ran into the street. I get hit by a semi, and I fucking die. I don't know where Tevin is to this day. I think he's okay. I think. I don't know. I never saw him after that, because I'm fucking dead.